Good evening, everybody. I'm Brad Means. I'm Jenny Montgomery. Thank you for joining us. Coverage you can count on begins with extra security measures at a local school. Students heading to class this week in Jefferson County are going to see more security, all to help protect them from a series of threats. News Channel 6's Renetta Dubose spent the day there, and Renetta, a teacher, actually discovered the threat. Yeah, Jefferson County High School teacher. She took a group of students to the bathroom this week, and that's when this all started. Now, there's an investigation into who made the threat, and it looks like the sheriff's office and the school district have keyed in on who the suspect might be. And some of the students were talking about something that was written in the bathroom. It was a bathroom break that could have saved everyone's life at Jefferson County High School. So the teacher immediately went into the bathroom, um, found what the students were talking about, uh, took a picture of that uh, to um, capture uh, the writing, and that's going to be very instrumental in finding the individual. Superintendent Molly Howard told News Channel 6 the district began working with the sheriff's office as soon as the writing was discovered Monday in the boys' bathroom. One of them said school shooter, and the other one said, I'm shooting up the school on 2217. Sheriff Gary Hutchins says the threat came again on Wednesday in two different locations on a wall in the bathroom stall. At that time, our officers started working with, closely with the uh, school officials, doing interviews and uh, looking at videos. With the help of Richmond County Sheriff's Office, Sheriff Hutchins says the two offices brought canine units to sniff out bombs, too, and increase security. The search revealed at least one student had a gun on school grounds. A weapon was found in the automobile in the parking lot. It was a stolen weapon. That student is not believed to be involved with the threat, but the investigation is still ongoing. And to continue to pray for the schools, uh, to make the decisions and to pray for our community and our society um, that we live in a time that threats are upon us, whether we're at school, work, um, in a restaurant, or even in a house of worship. All right, we will be praying. Now, in the meantime, the sheriff stresses this is serious because schools are a place for learning, so the person will face serious felony charges. The superintendent Howard says teachers were very helpful in the investigation, naming each student who walked into that bathroom at the request of the Burke County School System. The Burke County Sheriff's Office deployed additional personnel to the Burke County High School campus this morning just to be safe. Jenny?